Let's have a look at trig functions. We're currently in the calculate menu. Uh, we're going to take a look at trig functions. Um, we're currently in radian mode. That's what the little R at the top of the screen means. So let's go with uh, pi over 3. So the pi is right above the x times 10 to the x power. So we're going to go um, pi shift and pi over 3. Sine of pi over 3. Square root of 3 over 2. Again, exact radical answer. We're just going to go ahead and edit this. We'll delete that. We'll say cosine of pi over 3. And we'll edit it one more time. Just to recycle that. Tangent of pi over 3. Now we'll change the mode of the angle. So the angles we want to go now into degree mode. So that we do something like the sine of 30. the cosine of 30, and the tangent of 30 degrees. And again, you can work backwards as well. So if you said arc tangent of the square root of 3 over 3, or 1 over the square root of 3. One over radical 3. Oh, I put the parentheses. Got to put that at the end there. Put that there. So you can work backwards as well. Just check the uh, mode. D means degrees, R means radians, G means gradient.